who we invited in today is in a very eclectic, skilled, gifted group of people, Mm -hmm. and we love them very much. Um, They are our Banning Omni Digital Creative Team. And I wanted to give a backstory of why we developed this team. John and I, um, way back in the day, um, this is now probably a year and a half, two years ago, when we were given the opportunity to have a campus Instagram and Facebook account. So (laughs) Facebook we got first. Mm -hmm. Then Instagram was about six months later. And we really, I mean, we had had our own accounts, but as far as a campus went, um, it was kind of like, um, releasing the hounds like we it gave us like all these opportunities to be creative and and um, share what was happening on our campus we really didn't know what we were doing we were trying all kinds of stuff and John's more creative than I am for sure but um, you know f- we learned a lot of different programs you know um, Canva and other things that we were using to try to make our posts look better but there was a point in time when we realized like we've capped out our ability mm-hmm. and our what margin we had left, right, John? Yeah, oh, absolutely. And um, so we needed people that had natural gifts and an eye for um, things that looked good. And uh, we we um, knew quite a few people on our campus who um, primarily are photographers. And the thing about photographers is they have an eye. Um, for beauty, they have an eye for what looks good, um, for coloring and light and all those kinds of things. And so we individually approached each of you and asked you if you would be interested and willing and had some margin in terms of your schedule to help us out um, to meet every other week, which we still do this day, um, meet um, every other week and talk about the campus calendar and upcoming events and and, um, how we can be more creative um, in our omni-digital approach. And so I wanted just to have you guys come in and first introduce yourselves and then share just a little bit about uh, what you do for a living, and then how you exercise your creative gift. It's a God-given gift, and uh, we want to um, capitalize on it and, and give God glory for it. But can you just share just um, who you are, what you do for a living, and a little bit about how you utilize your gift? Um, my name is Ryan Scott, and I've been doing photography since 2017. And um, I just love taking pictures. I started taking pictures of my daughters, and it just kind of grew from there. And now it's become like almost a full blown business for me and I love every minute of it and I'm happy to share my talent with my church and to capture moments here at the Banning Campus. That's awesome. And Gina? Hi, my name is Gina Diaz. I am a photographer, wedding and portraits. Um, I've been doing it professionally probably for, it's my only job for probably for 13 years now. And, um, what I do with my gifts and talent is I do weddings and portraits, headshots, pretty much all, anything the camera can be pointed at. And um, yeah, I was excited when you guys invited us to start this team, and it's been great. And Gina even was out at our leadership, uh, core leadership meeting um, yesterday on Sunday. I um, was taking uh, images of that, and we were able to put together just a collage of that event and just it it really actually makes it very special to be able to um, capture that and then share that with others Um, and you do you know all of you do amazing work on the behind the camera but it was just special to be able to even share that yesterday oh yeah and that's one nice thing about having not always doing things professionally you know getting paid or um like for other people Mm -hmm. um working with the church it's like you're doing it for yourself also so there's so much value in that. Um, just being able to just show up yesterday, get it done, and already have it, you know, delivered. And there's a diff- different uh, creativity aspect to that. And it, it makes a big difference between, I mean, it's amazing what you can do with a phone now. Oh, yeah. You know, um, phones do incredible things with video and uh, capturing images and then um, even modifying um, pictures. But... When you see somebody that really has a gift um, behind a camera and you see the after product, uh, it is shocking. Um, And so, I mean, it's starkly different. And so it's just a blessing to have 
um, such skilled uh, team members on our team here at Banning. And we have, uh, man, just all the gifts that are assembled even around this table. Um, I know of them because I've seen all of you guys' work. Um, but it's just fun to, to be able to see you guys in action, not just at the church, but in, in what you do professionally. So, Kayla, why don't uh, you go next? Hi, I'm Kayla. Um, I have been doing photography for a couple years now. Um, I do weddings and families, lifestyle sessions, um, that kind of stuff. Anything that I can get with and capture with my camera, I am happy. So being able to be able to bring my camera here and capture the families and the events and stuff that goes on, like it blesses my heart too because I get to, to do that for these people that I love and um, call family. But yeah, other than that, I'm a mom, but photography is my passion and – and, and what you told us before is that Michael taught you everything you know uh, behind yeah. the camera, right? So, yeah. like, he, he started, and then he taught you, and then you've kind of run with it. You actually, you're very gifted, too, in addition to an, uh, just being an amazing photographer. You also uh, um, have run with our, like, videos, yes. um, TikTok <laughs> videos and, and Instagram reels and stuff like that, and we need that that creative like outlet. figuring out, like, pieces and how they – they can fit together and flow together. Just anything that I can build and put together, that's just something that I love. Yep. So. And some, a lot of times now when we get together um, for our um, Omni Digital team, creative team meetings, um, we just do like creative planning. Mm-hmm. Um, like, hey, let's just, can we, can we capture something right now? Um, and we even did something for baptism in, um, you know, getting ready for our, the baptism we just had. That was just fun. Uh, to see, hey, we have an hour and a half together. Um, what can we produce? What product can we get get out during our time? And um, it's stuff that that I would have to spend an inordinate amount of time thinking about, and I would never get the end product because I'm just not. That's just not my natural gifting. But you stick a bunch of creatives in a room together, and uh, wow, it just it just happens. It's fun because we get to bounce the ideas off each other. Like somebody will bring up something. And then you kind of just like piggyback off one another until you form this product in your head. And then just being able to execute it and see what comes together, that's super fun. That's great. And Michael. All right. Um, Yeah, Michael Roisin. You want to know what I do for the team? Uh, I do for a living first. For a living? All right. Uh, I'm an internet marketer. I do uh, copywriting, and I also do some other on terms I won't throw around because most people don't know what they mean. So, <laughs> no, I don't do law. Copywriting, not the law, but the writing of marketing copy. Yeah, which <laughs> which has been helpful too for us. Like you've given us some advice on, you know, some of the stuff that we've sent out, even uh, emails and mm-hmm. um, getting the word out about our campus, um, taking flyers to uh, neighborhoods and inviting people to church and, and the wording that we would use for that. So we, even utilizing that gifting oh, yeah. and, and also just experience in that field because you work for corporations mm-hmm. um, who, you know, they pay for your service and they, yeah. they want the best product and you've learned a lot um, oh, yeah. in that industry. And so it's been a beneficial for us to um, in that. But you're also a photographer. Yeah, well, one of many hobbies that I have, uh, <laughs> I don't really do it as much. But I, I like doing it. It's just um, not everyone, for some reason, wants portraits. So I'm like, oh, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll just, that he's takes really on. good at it. Yeah, he's very, <laughs> yeah, very man, good man. at it. Yeah. Things. Yeah, I, I love, uh, the stuff I really enjoy doing is like sports photography and yeah, stuff that you would probably see in like Sports Illustrated or Nike. Like I love that kind of stuff. That's right. Lighting and yeah, I love I like I love to overcomplicate yeah. things. So that's <laughs> that's why I like playing with lights because it can get very complicated, unnecessarily complicated. But that's I just like overcomplicating everything. So that's why I do it. That's awesome. <laughs> well, um, I'm gonna have John share. Uh, we're super super thankful for you guys and and the time that you commit um, to this team and the work that's happening in this campus. John, um, any thoughts? Yeah, I mean, it's just one of those things where we were just super excited when they gave us an opportunity to, like, actually share creatively um, and have some autonomy there. Um, And we really honestly did, we hit a a level where, like, I am a creative person. I have that in me. I'm very creative. But, like, there's a certain level of where you hit a plateau of, like, what your capacity is. And 
when it comes to like being on a team at church, like we all have to kind of come together to make things happen. And when you have this many people with this much creative ability, this much gifting, um, it makes it a lot easier. And the, the, the level that you're at goes so much higher, like Pastor Brian was saying. So just having so many different people, maybe you, you guys all have like, you can all take pictures, right? You could all take photos, but you guys all have different eyes and you guys all have different, uh, brains and different things that you see. Um, you guys all have your own unique styles, you know, you guys are all super talented in that way. And so it's just cool to see all of that collectively come together and, um, just it, for us, we see pictures that you guys share with us after you guys have taken them, and we're just like, are we're high fiving. We're like, are you <laughs> kidding me? Like, are you kidding me? The quality is so good. You guys are so talented, and we're so blessed to have you guys. Absolutely. I, I'm finishing off on this. The the Word of God says we are His workmanship, created in Christ Jesus for good works, which He prepared in advance that we would walk in. And that that word workmanship is um, poema in the Greek. It's like, you know, poetry. um, It's the way God designed each of us uniquely and beautifully. And, um, you know, the creative gift, not everyone has. Mm -hmm. And um, I think it's very special. We can all see it when it's in action. And there's a variety of different outlets for it. You guys just happen to have an eye um, particularly um, with regard to photography, it's not your only giftings, but it is definitely one that stands out. And uh, man, when you see that in the body of Christ, you want you want um, t- for it to be utilized. Um, and you guys are, are happy to do that. It's a blessing to have you on our team. We get along great. We have a fun time with it. Looking forward to even where we're going to go from here. Um, so we're just thankful that you guys are willing to not only be on the team, but come in and share a little bit about yourself and what you do. And um, so thank you. Yeah, thank you. Awesome. Yeah, thank right. you.